How's it going to run? My name is Nicholas and welcome to a brand new video. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to modify dispatcher calls. Whether you had additional information added and you would like to inform all units attached to the call, or you made a mistake in the location or postal. So, as you guys could see in front of me, I have the, uh, the group to create the calls, and then I have a repeating group that shows all the active calls. To make this, you guys have to go and check out another video on how to create the dispatcher page. That's where I showed how to make it. So, if you have that done, you have it all created, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to get a little icon. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna copy the trash icon and right next to it, I'm going to modify it a bit. So instead of a trash, it's going to be a pencil. That stands for editing. So make it yellow. All right, let's move it up here and we double click on it and then we start slash edit workflow we click here elements action and set state so let's set a state it's gonna be CAD create state let's call this uh, selected call and then it's gonna be called create Serial call. Current cell call is the current cell selected by this, so it will actually know which uh, cell you created and which one is going to be selecting. So, all we have that done, let's make a little pop up. It's going to be this small. I'm going to paste this in. We modify this and we call it edit call. Now, we go here, we double click on it again, start slash edit workflow, and look for display data, which is gonna be to the pop-up, and it's gonna be current cell calls. Now we go back, and we open the pop-up. Now we're gonna have to go to the place folder, get this deleted. It's gonna be current cell thing, no wait. You're gonna scroll all the way down, CAD, current selected CAD, and this is gonna be call, call source. We're gonna do the same thing here, add the default value, scroll all the way down until you find CAD, select, and then it's gonna be call source. So, CAD is basically the name of the page. So, as you can see here, it says CAD, this is the name of the page and whatever you call your page is going to be the same it doesn't have to be called cad it could be called dispatch it could be called control panel whatever you like to call it so let's go back we're gonna do the same thing here i'm gonna get this deleted uh cad current cell current call sorry and this one is going to be the call description same thing here call description you're gonna have to do it for all of these then scroll down again this one is going to be call location here you go call location all right let's edit this and say edit edit current call now click on it and then we're going instead of creating a new thing we're gonna make a changes to a thing so it's going to be changes to cad selected and that's what you need to do now put the new information in you don't need the call number you need the description source and location so the source is going to be i i think it's i believe it's this one if I'm not mistaken, let's double check. This is going to be description. This is going to be call source. Yep. Okay. Now for call source, it should be this one. And for location, it should be this one. Now, what we do is hide the pop-up. And then we go back. Now we click on the little icon, 
and then we show the pop-up. Alright, now let's see if it works. Alright, as you can see we have this call right here. If you want to edit it, click the edit button. You can see it has the same information. This time, instead of police, I want it to be fire slash EMS, edit call. And there you go. It adds the call. Let's put some random numbers here. And let's put a random postal. I'm not sure if this is an actual postal in Static Shores, but... Alright. There you go. Now it works. I think I missed adding the location, but that's fine. So, that is it for this video. It's a really short video. Teaching you guys how to edit the calls. I did not include it in the dispatch video because I forgot about it. So... I hope you guys enjoy, if you do, slap a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video, peace.